It is September 7th, 2025. We're going over to the Central Pacific Ocean where we have major hurricane Kiko on its way towards Hawaii. Now it's moving slowly at 13 miles per hour on a west northwest course. It has a central eye pressure of 965 millibars and it's still a Cat 3 hurricane with winds of 115 miles per hour. So it's holding on to that major hurricane status as it moves towards Hawaii. Now, Hawaii is currently in high pressure ridge and as Kiko moves towards Hawaii, it's gonna fight this high pressure and weaken and the wind speeds are gonna drop and it's gonna be into a category one or category two hurricane status as it passes by the big island of Hawaii. Now this is gonna happen around Tuesday morning in the early hours of Tuesday and move on into Wednesday up to the northeast of the Hawaiian Islands. Now this will bring strong rip currents and larger surf and swell to the islands and the beaches facing east will experience the majority of the swell and waves. However, it won't be a direct hit. Now why? Because as Hurricane Kiko weakens, it's going to be more deflected by the chorus effect and move further north in latitude and also fight this higher pressure that's persistent in the North Pacific Ocean. So Kiko is gonna run out of steam and energy in the next coming days as it passes by and brushes the Hawaiian Islands.